Hey guys, it's Carrie. Tiger, tigers, as well as many other predator species are right at the top of the ecological pyramid. If the tiger disappears from the top, it will upset the balance. The hind legs are longer than the front legs. This enables them to leap forward distances up to 10 meters. The bones of the tiger's front legs are strong and dense to support the large musculature needed to take down large prey. The bones in each of the tiger's feet are tightly connected by ligaments enabling them to buffer the impact of landing from running, pouncing and leaping. Their large padded feet enable them to silently stalk prey in the Asian jungles. The tiger's claws grow to 10 centimeters and are curved which enables them to superiorly grasp and hold large prey as it struggles and climb trees head first. Black panthers are in fate leopards with melanism an excess of dark pigment and if you look carefully you can see the spots through their black fur. In jaguars the melanism is dominant consequently black jaguars may produce either black or spotted cubs but a pair of spotted jaguars can only produce spotted cubs. In black jaguars or black leopards the background colour may appear to be dark charcoal rather than black. White bison It is an American bison with white fur and is considered sacred or spiritually significant in several Native American religions. Therefore such buffalo are often visited for prayer and other religious rituals. Please subscribe and turn on notifications. Zebra, a cornered zebra rears, kicks and bites in defense. There have been numerous recorded cases of zebras killing lions, generally by a swift kick to the head that at the very least breaks the jaw, resulting in the cat's eventual starvation. White rhino, they live in groups of up to 10 animals. Like elephants, rhinos communicate using infrasonic frequencies that are below the threshold of human hearing. The white rhinoceros also has a prominent muscular hump that supports its relatively large head. The colour of this animal can range from yellowish brown to slate grey. Most of its body hair is found on the ear fringes and tail bristles with the rest distributed rather sparsely over the rest of the body. White rhinos have the distinctive flat broad mouth that is used for grazing. Blue footed booby The booby is a seabird in the genus Sula. Boobies hunt fish by diving from a height into the sea and pursuing their prey underwater. Facial air sacs under their skin cushion the impact with the water. The green-cheeked Amazon parrot. Many Amazon parrots have a remarkable ability to mimic human speech and other sounds. The crocodile can hear well. Their tympanic membranes are concealed by flat flaps that may be raised or lowered by muscles. The saltwater crocodile is often claimed to be the largest living crocodilian. Males can grow to 6 meters or 20 feet. The saltwater crocodile is a large and opportunistic hypercarnivorous apex predator. It ambushes most of its prey and then drowns or swallows it whole. It is capable of prevailing over almost any animal that enters its territory, including other apex predators such as sharks, varieties of freshwater and saltwater fish, 
including pelagic species, invertebrates such as crustaceans, various reptiles, birds and mammals, and human beings. The hippopotamus remains cool by staying in the water or mud during the day. The hippo is among the most dangerous animals in the world as it is highly aggressive and unpredictable. They are threatened by habitat loss and poaching for their meat and ivory canine teeth. They belong to the genus of the family Hippopotamidae. They are also classified along with other even-toed ungulates in the order Artiodactyla. Indian elephant. The trunk is a prehensile elongation of its upper lip and nose. This highly sensitive organ is innervated primarily by the trigeminal nerve and thought to be manipulated by between 40 and 60,000 muscles. Because of this muscular structure, the trunk is so strong that elephants can use it for lifting about 3% of their own body weight. Elephants have a pharyngeal pouch just behind the tongue. It facilitates sound production as a resonating chamber for calls emitted at frequencies below the range of human hearing. Elephants as far away as 4 kilometers can respond to these calls. This pouch can also carry water. There's an elephant calf hiding behind its mother. Lion with reproduction courtship may be initiated by either female or male. They keep within one to three meters of each other while consorting. The female may lie down, jump up and walk and roll and twist on her back. The male follows the female at all times, often resting with her. He may lick her neck, back or rump which is uncommon any other time outside of courtship. The female may not accept his advances or may playfully avoid him. The male assesses her receptiveness by using the flamen response and smelling the female's urine. They mate continuously for a period of three to four days. The female invites copulation by lordosis, a reflexive behaviour in fellows. Copulations are brief but frequent, lasting a minute or less and may occur as often as three times per hour. During copulation, the female purrs loudly or emits a deep growl. The female will turn and snarl as the male dismounts. Contact ends abruptly after copulation. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.